Let's talk about the iconic Chesapeake Bay. It lines most of Hampton Roads. While things are looking up, there's still a lot of work to do. This is uh, from the Chesapeake Bay Program's annual report. Joining me to break down the findings, Tanner Council with the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. Tanner, thank you for being here. Thanks for having me. All right, let's talk about the good news first. Uh, this goes by the Bay Barometer. Correct. What are we seeing this year? Uh, EPA, Environmental Protection Agency, yeah. puts out a, a report uh, periodically called the Bay Barometer. It's for the Chesapeake Bay Program. I'd like to clarify that it's not Chesapeake Bay Foundation. We put out our separate report. Okay. Okay. Um, and the, uh, the report this year, they had some very promising findings. Oysters were up, um, grasses were up, protected lands were up, and overall water quality had improved. Okay. Let's talk about some of the bad news, maybe. Sure. Well, we had different reports, um, but the, we, we completely agree with the, the Bay Barometer. They took into uh, account data from 2015 to th 2017. Okay. Our data included 2018, where we had those record rainfalls. Yeah. So we had a lot more pollution washing into the Bay from all different sources, nitrogen, phosphorus, and sediments specifically. Okay. What's the, uh, outside of that, are there current other major threats that we do on a day-to-day -day basis? Maybe we can improve and help out? Well, the reports show that the work is, is progressing and we're seeing the efforts, the decades of efforts really starting to pay off. So the most important thing that we can do is to ensure the funding uh, for this program, the Chesapeake Bay program. Um, the White House's proposed budget has slashed the funding and so we're working very hard to help restore that funding. Yeah. Congressman Elaine Loria has sponsored some very important legislation which will do that so your viewers can support that legislation. They can go out and they can volunteer, clean the Bay Days coming up, and then there's lots of local clean water plans that they can get involved with public comment period coming up very soon. So Tanner, you yourself, you've seen these reports before. Where do you kind of stand on this report? I mean, do you feel good about it? Are you kind of on the negative side? Well, we, we love to see progress. And overall, uh, the progress of the Bay is improving. We see this anecdotally too. People talk yeah. about clean water events. People talk about seeing more grasses and the fishing's better. Um, but I'm always, I have sort of a guarded optimism um, because there's a lot of work left to do. Um, and so 58% of our water, waterways in Virginia still fail to meet basic fishable, swimmable standards. So okay. I just say keep the pedal to the metal double down on the funding and keep up the hard work. All right, Tanner Council with the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. Appreciate you being Thank here. Thank you very much. Appreciate Thank you. It. Take care.